Dear 16-year-old me, two pieces of advice that I want to give to you. First is that uh, it's not such a serious thing, but this summer I think you should go on a travel program that you want to go on instead of working at the camp. Take my advice. Second piece of advice that I want to give is, you know, whenever you see, you know, friends of yours who are, you know, maybe not so being so nice to everybody and not so nice to other people, don't follow their lead. Be, be your own person, be your own individual, and you're a kind person, so be that person. So the reason that I would say the first one is because, you know, the summer you have after like, when you're 16 wasn't so great, so choose the, choose the confident experience. And the reason that I'll give you the second piece of advice is because it's the real you. You know, the kinder person is, you know, the more compassionate person is the real you. So don't go along with everyone else. Dear 16-year-old, I think this is a good advice that I give to you. First thing is, first advice, do whatever you want, do whatever you dream. Don't be afraid to dare, don't be afraid to paint, don't be afraid to sing, don't be afraid to dance. Just, you're very talented, you should accomplish whatever you want to do, because eventually you older you understand that uh, dancing, singing, art, painting is that's where your peaceful place is, that's where you feel complete. The second piece of advice that I give to you is eventually I think when you get older you understand how much your mom is very important to you. So my piece of advice to you is just Try to see the other side of what she is. When you're 16, you think, you know, she's, she's tough, you're, you're a teenager, even when you're 20, mom is a very special person. So show it to her. Show your love. Even, that, even though that you do love her, just show it to her. Because eventually, along the way, that you didn't do it. Okay. The future looks crazy and depressing, um, but it's a journey, so you will survive, and you should just keep going. Every day is gonna come, and the next one's gonna come. I'm telling myself that you are gonna keep living. The second piece of advice to my 16-year-old self is to trust your instincts, trust your gut, you are who you are, and it's okay to be who you are, even if the rest of the world tells you that you're crazy, or you're nuts, or you should do something else. Uh, when somebody says they love you, they have to show you that they love you. By treating you in a way that makes you feel better about yourself. I'm telling this to my 16-year-old self because I believed that somebody loving me meant that if somebody was going to love me it's because I did something for them and that I was good enough for them instead of just good enough for myself and that if somebody loves me they love me because of who I am not because of stuff I'm doing for them. Dear future me, I hope that right now you found yourself and that you're happy and that you're right where you want to be and no matter what you've been going through or have been through you're doing fine because right now things seem just a little bit rocky so I hope that you've made everything balanced.